There are around 85 local veterans in this room, all jumping on a plane tomorrow bright and early for the Texas Panhandle Honor Flight. They're going to Washington, D.C., and News Channel 10 is going with them. Armstrong County will make a decision for their budget coming up this year. How that may affect law enforcement, more tonight at 10. I'm at the Amarillo Fire Department where in just a few hours, Abigail Smith, a kindergartner battling brain cancer, will arrive to be named fire chief for a day. More coming up on this later for News Channel 10, I'm Christy Rose. Amarillo College celebrated 90 years yesterday. The original AC location opened its doors on Lincoln Street downtown for the first time on September 16, 1929. Only 86 students were on the inaugural roll call. Now around 10,000 students are enrolled in courses. Celebratory events will be held throughout the academic school year to mark the occasion. Happy State Bank is coming in like a wrecking ball, taking down the old AIG building. Coming up at 6, we'll tell you more about the plans that Happy State Bank has for this property. For News Channel 10, I'm Christy Rose. The city of Amarillo just approved the Health Bridge grant. The money awarded will be used to target obesity and other chronic illnesses by implementing different lifestyle classes. The last step in the process is just waiting on Texas to approve the final contract. Reporting for News Channel 10, Christy Rose.